Hello everybody and welcome back to Minecraft SOS. And after the chaos of the last episode, currently we only have three fake coins to our name. Which is not much, it's exactly half to revive someone. And in this hardcore SMP, we're gonna need those fake coins to live. Hopefully we get a couple extra ones in our pocket because if not, our friends could be gone. Forever. And to remember our fallen friends, let's head over to the candle and update the death count. Oh, and there is a lot of updating we need to do since the last time we did this. Hello, Ghost Kitty! Thank you for guarding all these beautiful candles. And the way I have this all set up, the pink one, which is two over here, this is Ollie. We have Jimmy over here with the yellow canary cursed flavored candles with three. This is me with one, now it's two. Mog, because he's handling all the bee stuff, we have orange with four, currently still in the lead. Pixarus with one, and he's gray because of the stone of the hole. Eloisa had it at two, but you know what? It was only one. Let me, uh, let me edit that. Sorry, Eloisa, I gave you an extra one. I could have sworn you died again, but eh, I was wrong. Lizzie had two. We gotta update that to three now. Rest in peace, Lizzie. Two of those were straight up murder, by the way. Just like mine were. Scott and Joel, hmm, it's okay. I forgive them. I am an angel after all. And we're gonna be adding two more right over here. Purple, this is gonna be for Joey. Rest in peace. One of these, the green one, is gonna be for Joel. Shrek is life, Shrek is love. And the lime, I'm gonna put this for Shelby. Shelby perished recently as well. I picked green because he has a mossy roof. I didn't know what else to pick, <laughs> it's fine. And now for a little moment of silence, please press F in the comment section to pay your respects. Okay, moment over. This is probably not gonna be the last time we head over to that candlelight visual area. But hopefully we won't be back there for a very long time. Oh, and I have some good news. Flip and Owen have come up with a really cool idea to get some new fake coins. I think they're gonna charge us, but either way, we're gonna need it. Let's head over. I think they're by Eloise's place. And that'll be 10 diamonds for you, sir. Stack uh, you know seeds? what, I'm rich. That's a great take tip, it, thank, take you. It. thank you. I've been thank making you. a no lot problem. of money off you guys. All right, and okay, now, can I go first? I would recommend you stand about like right here and just have the bow ready. And when you hear screaming, shoot. Okay. And ah, I will tell you. Not, not you're yet. screaming. Ah, you know, leather. Oh, oh hey! one thing for you. Yay. It's next. that easy, folks. Thank you for your business. <laughs> <laughs> <I'm> <laughs> not allowed. Got it. Hey! Speedier, please. I'm so. I didn't know it was coming. I should have gotten a warning or something. There you go, sir. No, 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 no. Don't bring it yet. Another one. Owen, there are very many of them. Make hey, it stop. Uh, no, you, uh, we can for five diamonds. <laughs> Great to have you both as uh, yeah. as customers. Yeah, yes, this, is, this is my pleasure. I do need another one after you're dying welcome. last time. You're welcome. Yeah, y'all you're, are welcome. Thank you so much for being a part of it. Man, who would have thought bringing the gas into the overworld and then killing it was going to give you a fake coin? I'm glad these people are testing these weird ones out because I wouldn't want to try that on my own. I have no idea what, he, what it took to get that guy out there. But it was easy for me and worth the 10 diamonds because you know what? Your boy's rich. Man, I wonder what other advancements are gonna give that fake coin. At the beginning, it was a lot of easy ones, but you know what? There was a couple hard ones as well. The careful restoration gave us one. I wonder if this one does. That seems like a difficult one. I'm almost all the way there, actually. We still haven't done the pillager one. Eh, that could be too simple. Well, what do you guys think? What advancements should I be trying to go for here? Ooh, this could be a good one. Great view from up there. Oh, I tried to get that one in the end cities, but that is a very dangerous one. I could actually die trying that one. So I gave up on it. Maybe we could try that again. Hold the dragon egg. Oh, maybe that's a thing. It's heist time. I wish I had all these music for this, but I think I know what the dragon egg is. Let's give this one a shot. All right, sneaky music activated. I believe, oh, there it is. Oh, perfect. Villagers, don't tell anybody about this, okay? Nobody must know. Um, I just need to do this very carefully. Um, so how would I do this if I just get rid of this guy? Oh no, I messed up. I need to put a torch under this. Okay, I can easily fix this. Let's uh, waterlog this for now. Get rid of you. Put a torch here. Get rid of this one. And I got it. Fake coin? Fake coin? Fake coin? Okay, no fake coin. I've been spotted. Shelby spotted me. Yeah, let's uh, <laughs> let's just say that. <laughs> ah, I am desperate. So let's put that back. Drop the water in here. Do a little parkour. Oh, parkour. Place that here. Oh, um, hmm. I think it was facing this direction. Perfect. And back up like nothing ever happened. <laughs> I'm leaving now. Don't tell Flip. 
Okay, that wasn't one. Please, give me your best guesses in the comment section. What advancement do you think is going to give me a fake coin? We'll keep trying <laughs> all, all day, probably. Or maybe later on down the line. Oh, wait. Um, eight fake coins? How did I get eight fake coins? Oh, no, it was inside the pot. I just stole all Flip's fake coins. <gasps> now we know where it is. Ooh, you never know. We might need it again. Let's just put it back. Let's just put it back for now. Uh, this is a break in case of emergency. We need to rob people later on down the line. But for right now, shh, don't tell them. Don't tell them I know where it is. I go put it back. I go put it back. I can't believe it. I was like, wait a minute. What? I got eight fake coins right here. Ah, uh, let's put it back. <laughs> Unless this was the face telling me that I deserve these eight. Okay, I don't think it's that. I think I just robbed him. Okay. Putting it back. Sorry, I had no idea. Uh, so, sorry. Oh, I'm leaving now. I'm leaving. Phew! I could have gotten in trouble for that one. Oh, baby, it's officially time to go inside Pix's hole and get to work. We're going to be digging out a big old chunk and helping him out with that project. And you know what? I always wanted to be part of something bigger. And that hole... Man, that's big. But I don't think I could do it with the outfit that I have on right now. I don't want to dirty it. I want something more hole digging appropriate. So let's go change really quick. And here we go. I am ready to work in Pix's hole. Man, it's going to be very sweaty out there. And I just want to make sure I got nothing to restrict me, my movements, from smashing up that stone, you know? So, of course, I got to take my shirt off, you know? <laughs> I don't, don't want to don't wanna get my shirt dirty or nothing. <laughs> it is pretty cute. I still have my wings on. They're permanently attached to me, so that I, there's nothing I can do about that. But look at this outfit. Isn't that amazing? Isn't that glorious? Jimmy's going to love this outfit, by the way. It's inspired by Jim. Now, I think I'm fully prepared. We have empty shulker boxes to transport all the stones and stuff that we get. I got an efficiency 5 pickaxe here with mending. Another one here. Fortune, but with mending. But this one, it needs mending. Let's add it. We have a good amount of levels. We can go ahead and use this. Perfecto. We do have our shovel to shovel some stuff. We do have our hoe right here. The demon bringer scythe of power. Who's going to help with the deep slate levels? All right, now I'm ready to get to work. Hole, 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 hole. I am ready to get to work. Oh my goodness, what? <laughs> you, you've come dressed in your, your finest magic mic outfit. Yeah, what Hello? magic mic? Yeah, this is what? not a magic mic outfit. This is a hole digging outfit. This is inspired by Jim. Oh my goodness, we have oh. a full... Hello, I heard we're here to dig holes. Yes! We're also yes. here to dig the hole. Oh my goodness, there's so many I... people interested already. Yeah. Absolutely. Wow, um, you've made some real progress here. This is I, crazy. I, I have, yep. yeah. Remember, last time you were here, I think, is when you were rescuing me from being a chicken, Owen. Yes. So, uh, stuff has happened been here since. in the meantime. That's a lot of holes. terrifying. A stone's throw how... away. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Now, where do we dig? Uh, so, the idea is any of the chunks where you see the signs, those are basically grid references for the chunks. So, uh -huh. pick, pick one of those, hit F3 and G so it shows the chunk borders, and go to town. There are only four of them that I'm saving in case we have a chance to do like a 2v2v2v2 contest to sick. see who can dig out got the chunk it, the fastest. Got it. But I'm going to do that when there are only those chunks left, so it's going to be okay. The grand finale for the whole. Well, oh, and, and, and and you, you should know also by doing this, you are officially in a cult. So you don't end up having to combine those. No, two no, 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 no. Sure. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, this is a cult. Uh, once you once you enter, you can. I'm just least... help. I'm okay. just doing a neighborly favor. To to clarify, Jimmy has made it a cult. The cult is nothing to do with me. <laughs> I'm here for the cult. <laughs> that sounds is like something a cult, cult leader would say. Yep. I mean, I, I, I've been, I've been, <laughs> I may have been appointed a cult leader against my will. Oh, right. okay. Let me get one with the hole. Hold on. Um, um, You're providing your own beacon noises. <laughs> oh, yes, I'm ready to get in. <laughs>
What just happened? Why did you die to an Enderman, please? So I went to the Enderman farm thinking, sure, I'm going to enchant myself a nice pickaxe. Isn't that going to be lovely? Yeah. What, what a thing to do when you've got so much digging to do. And so it turns out that a bunch of Endermen must have followed whoever left the farm last, which might have been me. Oh, no. <laughs> I have R2. Okay, I got two. I got Huey. two. I'm good. I have two left after this. This is fine. Welcome to my number, big man. You're just like me. As good a Minecrafter as me. How's that hey, you died, I died twice as well. I need oh. to go and up update my gravestone in the graveyard. The thing is, for me, I've only died... I, well, I've died because of murder. People have murdered me, so there was no, no natural causes. Well, a death no. is a death. No, there were murders. Well, they were different. Murder is murder. Murder yeah. is murder. Death is death. Yeah, they, they, they killed me. I, you know, I, I was assassinated. You see the amount of endermen that are down here? That's oh. how many I had attacking me, it turns out. One of them is now angry at someone. Is it because I looked at... I think really? I... Yes. Oh, Ollie? I think I looked at the glass. I <laughs> <laughs> We're doing it. Fly back in. Fly don't back in. Don't make anyone mad in the meantime. Okay. Yeah. Don't look at don't anything. Don't make it too quick. Otherwise, we'll, you will you will die. You will go splat. Just, I don't want that. Okay. Gentle glide. I gentle can't glide. Can't this. Oh, you, glide. your face is on the wrong side of the. It's, yeah, I know. Oh, I'm looking no. out over the void, contemplating okay. my mistakes. How do I get the angle? <laughs> okay, both of mine are in. Both of mine so are in. Down here. Oh, there. You can. There. Oh. Oh, oh God. Oh. You said, oh. Oh. Welcome back, sweet king. Oh, God, that was... <laughs> oh, my entire life flashed before my eyes, and I hated it. Oh, oh God. Never oh. again. Back to the hole with you. No more <laughs> ending. Yeah, back in the hole. 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 I've got two hole. pickaxes to enchant, hole. and I still need to do it. Oh, I hate the end of it so much. Oh man, what a glorious experience that was. Being inside Pixis Hole for four hours really does something to someone. It started out with just me flipping Owen. Later on, Shelby came by, Ollie came by. It was a great time. And Pixis Hole, man, it is mighty powerful, isn't it? So many people have lost their lives in that hole. And even Pixaris has died being away from that hole. He gave his life in this very holing, as I like to call it. The great holing of 2024. But I came out of that a changed man. I want to do something special to commemorate our time with the hole and have something here in our base to pay tribute. And you know what? The hole has giveth just as much as it taketh away. Because <laughs> in these shulker boxes, these are all items from the hole which we're going to be using for our build. Look at all that diorite. Even more as well. Even more. And we built pretty decently sized builds in our area. Nothing too crazy big. I think the biggest might be the sanctuary over here in girthiness but in height it has to be the monolith but for an experience that we had in the hole i think we need something that matches the experience by building something pretty large and i think the spot right behind me might be perfect see this is technically our base here still the cutoff line is pretty much this path over here which goes at the spawn and this goes all the way down to catherine and mog's place and i think having it closer to spawn it's really going to help everybody on the server because then everybody can come along and pay tribute to the hole i think the first thing we need to do though is to clear some of these trees and really see the space we have to work with Check this out. Now, I've been doing a little bit of work just to make sure that this spot looks a little more natural because <laughs> initially this thing was like five blocks down. So I had to make a nice little mound and a little way up right over here, which is pretty cool. And the pond looks really nice still with this part lifted up. The area that Mog was working with right over here looks really cool connected to this part. So I wanted to make sure that this part looks just as good coming down this direction. And I did put a little bit of these lovely little pink guys, the lilacs, so we can match Catherine's vibe here with this pink 
So the transition looks pretty nice, coming all the way down this way and then curve it around to this side. Usually I do the path work last, but you know what? I did it first. So we have the path going up this direction and it's gonna end up with an entrance over here. And then another bit of path over here going from our base down this direction and this big old cathedral is gonna have three entrances. And I think I'm ready to get this started. But this time, because this is a special build, let me take you through the, the thought process of what I'm doing, how I'm doing it, and all the block palette stuff. And I have all of these shulker boxes ready for this build. I think it's the most shulker boxes I used for a single build so far here in this world. And it's gonna be worth it for the whole. Now let's place it all down right here. Eh, doesn't look like much down here on the ground. But as we saw before, we're gonna be using a lot of white blocks. Primarily diorite, polished diorite, white concrete, and even the lovely bone block with a little bit of white wool. Other blocks we're gonna be using is gonna be a lot of cobble deep slate. There's a lot more right there. That's gonna be for primarily our roof. A lot of stripped spruce wood over here for the interior. And even more blocks right here. So step number one, let's do a little bit of a layout so you see exactly how big this thing's gonna be. That's it. That is the outline I'm going with right here. We got a big door in the middle, side doors on each side, and then another side door back there. But I want it to look grand and really cool, specifically right here, if you're in the back part where the altar is, and you're looking down this direction, I want to have a big opening with high ceilings, rafters, cross beams, big windows on every corner. And if you notice these little gaps here between these posts, there's gonna be windows in between all of these. And then back here, we have a nice little rounded off back end and that whole roof is gonna be glass. I left a lot of gaps in between each one of these posts over here. And if you see those wood bits over there, I'm gonna be adding wood interior. So it's not just all diorite, even on the inside. So then now it's time for step number two. Let's do the interior. We go with the last minute finishing touches on the interior so we're gonna add a lot more around the side and right here we have a lovely tiny version of the hole right here in the back in the altar it looks so good but as you can see we have a big giant carpet going all the way from the entrance all the way to the altar here on the side aisles over there on that side and then cutting down towards here towards this exit and we got the interior spruce linings going down this way and i think this is a very cool interior also gonna have some pillars right over here and it's all gonna make sense in the end but i think with that we are ready to lift up some blocks here it comes the cathedral of the hole Welcome to the Cathedral of the Hole. I love how this cathedral turned out. Look at those little bit of cross beams up there, the hanging lights, chandeliers, everything here is looking so good. I even have some mossification up there on the roof, make it look old and overgrown like it's been here a very long time. And we have so many seats ready to go. I love this thing. I can't wait till everybody comes down and gives their allegiance to the hole. Does a little bit of uh, chanting for the hole as well. Give me a good hole chant in the, in the comment section. Oh, but man, this thing is beautiful. Look at all those details there with the anvils. We have lots and lots of anvils. I, um, I, yeah, I, I got a lot of anvils. 
but this thing looks so cool. And you know what I would like? You know how they have holy water, right? In cathedrals and stuff? I would like some whole water. Let's go grab some. Pigs! That really scared me. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Hello. Hi. I love your hole. It's doing great. You've chiseled away a little bit. Thank you. Yeah, it's going well. I, I managed to get another chunk done yesterday. So there's one in the corner now that's being saved for the contest. Oh, I can't wait for the contest. I'm going to win that contest. I already know the tricks. Yeah, you've, you've got you've got a, a head start on the, on the hole. Yeah, and I saw Owen beat me, but that's because I saved your life. I went to go save your life. I would have won. It's true, yeah. In, in the in the time lapse that I did of everything, uh, Fwip obviously like went for dinner or something halfway through that. But uh, yeah, Owen Owen trapped himself in a little box for a while. You went and saved me. There was yep. like just these little variations and stuff. Yeah, that was so lovely. So I, I've I've come here very quickly. I'm going to need um, a sample of your hole water. Oh, yeah, okay, that's fine. Yes, I'm going to go down deep because I, w whenever anybody comes to the cathedral, you know, they, c they can get a little sample and take it with they, them. They, they're going to be uh, anointed. Yeah, yes, uh -huh. I, I'll do baptisms as well, you know, on the weekends. <laughs> I'm, I'm, gl I'm glad to know the hole will be saving lives as well as ending them. <laughs> oh, yeah, the, 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 with this place, it does so much for, for the community. We love it. We love hole. Good stuff. All right, oh, enjoy. Thank you. Thank you so much. I love hole water as well. Wee! Yay, hole water! Just a little sample, just a little sample. Let's take just two of these and then I can make infinite amounts and I don't have to come back here. Oh, but I do love coming back here every single time. Oh, oh, oh man. So powerful just being in here again. Oh, and I know exactly where to put the whole water. So it'll be always whole water from here on in. It'll be attached to this beauty right here. The most magical of all fountains. Oh baby, take that. Oh, perfect. And now we make whole water. And I've put some in here already. We have some ready to go. So I will be the first to be baptized in the hole. One, two, three. Perfect. Now this holy cathedral, get it, holy, <laughs> is missing one key component. And that is a hole, which I'm going to be building right here. Or not building, I'm going to be destroying this hole. But I'm going to do it live on Twitch, probably on the next stream. So follow me over there. I'm going to put a link in the description. I'm going to put a little beacon down all the way at the bottom and then um, and then shoot it up right up uh, towards the sky over here. And we'll dig it together. But for now, I am out of here. Thank you all so much for watching. Get ready for the next episode. I have a feeling a new challenge is going to be taking place. Ah! Ah! Stop it! Do not disrespect the hole! Where did he come from? All who disrespect the hole will be destroyed. Oh well, see you in the next one.